Does it get any bigger than this? Sup guys, it's Frank here from AFTV Young Guns and today we are previewing the North London Derby. Now, this is completely unscripted. Usually when I do my previews, I've got like, little notes next to the screen uh, and I read from them, but this is completely unscripted. I'm just going to be saying what I think off the top of my head. Now, the question that I give to you guys is, has there ever been a more important North London Derby than this one? People may argue the North London Derby where we won the league at White Hart Lane, but I think this may be bigger. If this derby doesn't go well for us, then this could symbolise a shift in power in North London and the crown could be given to Tottenham. And I don't think I'd be able to live with that because the worst thing about it is, well, that Tottenham fans are so, so cocky about their club. Some other fans may say we're quite cocky, but personally, I don't believe we are. I, feel, I think we're unfairly treated more than cocky. So when we get something that we want, it makes us happier. Fun fact of the day, this is actually my first ever North London derby that I've actually been to. I've seen how hostile it can be. Uh, apparently, it's much, much worse in real life. I'm going to find out on Saturday. So, of course, this is a home game. Of course, I'm going to be ripping the home team with my home shirt. Yes, I am going to be wearing colours. I'm still going to be representing my team. Arsenal through and through. Um, this is definitely going to be one of the most important games I've actually ever been to. And it could be a very heartbreaking day if things don't go our way. Tottenham are 100% going to bring their A game. And we need to be ready for that. Another fun fact today. Tottenham have only ever beat us once at the Emirates Stadium. That fills me with some confidence. But this is this Arsenal. So that drags the confidence down as well. So what we're going to do is we're going to get into the team selection now and there's going to be a few shocking decisions that I make in this team selection. In goal, we're going for Petr Cech. Of course, David Ospina is still injured, as Troops likes to point out. I don't know why he doesn't like Cech. I think Cech's a great goalie, but to be fair, he can make some mistakes. Uh, right wing back, Hector Bellerin. There's no one else that we can play there. Left wing back, the tank himself, Sead Kolasinac. Three at the back, Koscielny. Nacho Monreal and I think it's time to bring Rob Holding back in. I've heard some reports that Mustafi may be fit for the game. If he is fit then 100% play him but if not Rob Holding has to be the man. The two in the centre of midfield Jack Wilshire has to be in this team. He knows what a derby is and he will be crucial in this game. And then next to him we are going for Aaron Ramsey. Granite Jack is not going to be in this team uh, because in this game that is going to be a certain red card. And we really don't need that. On the left wing, we are going for Alex Awobi. Now, sounds very stupid, but there is no Alexis Sanchez in this team. As much as I don't want to do this, I don't think Alexis Sanchez's head is at the club. I think he's playing for himself and that's really not going to help in this game. Alex Awobi has come through the youth system. He knows what Arsenal and Tottenham is about. He needs to be playing in this game. Forget how he's been playing in these past few weeks. That goes out the window. He needs to get the job done again against Tottenham. Right wing, again, no Meza Ozil. Again, I don't think his heart's in the club anymore. Theo Walcott comes in. Listen, now, this is the this this is this is the decision that people are going to hate on me for in the comments. What's Theo Walcott doing in this team? He's not fit to wear the shirt. He knows what playing Tottenham is about. Again, been at the club since 2006. He knows the North London derby. Anyone remember this moment? And then up top, the man himself, Olivier Giroud. No, no, I'm joking, I'm joking. I am not Arsene Wenger. I am not benching Alex Lacazette. Lacazette has to go up top. Lacazette has to go up top. We cannot be affording to lose him or waste him in this game. Now, I'm feeling pretty confident with that team. Uh, my prediction for this game, I always get North London Derby, Derby predictions wrong. I always do. If I say an Arsenal win, it's going to be a Tottenham win. If I say a Tottenham win, it will be an Arsenal win. But I'm feeling very confident and I'm going to say a 2-1 Arsenal win. So anyway, guys, that's what I think is going to happen in the game. Make sure to let me know what you think is going to happen in the comments. Thank you for watching this video. If you did like it, make sure to leave a like or subscribe to AFTV Young Guns. I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Now subscribe to AFTV Young Guns, please. Thank you. All you Arsenal fans out there, you young Arsenal fans, I recommend AFTV Young Guns. Do it. Cheers, thank you.